can I ask you something? Where do you live? Obviously in a house. I also live in my house. I mean, what sort of question was that? But have you ever wondered that if we have to find the elements together, where can we find them out? I mean, it's it's a little ambiguous question because they're not they cannot be found together at one place. But there's one thing in which we can find all the elements together and we can know what is their atomic number and what is their atomic mass. You must be wondering why I said that. But yes, the answer is we can find all the elements present in nature and that has been identified by the scientists in a table and that table is known as periodic table. As you can see the table before you, it's very simple. In, in a periodic table, the elements are arranged in groups and in periods. Now you must be wondering what are groups? So the columns, the columns that we have represents the groups. There are eight groups in the periodic table and the horizontal lines, they are known as periods. So elements are arranged in groups and periods. In total, there are eight groups and seven periods. So elements are arranged in a periodic table in the increasing order of their atomic numbers. This is a very short description of what a periodic table is. We are going to study each group and its elements in detail in the next videos of periodic table. If you have any query regarding this video, do let me know in the comment section.